Hello everybody. <laughs> the kid is behind the camera. Say hello. Hello. So we've both been having some pretty crazy buttered chicken cravings, but our favorite restaurant that we usually get it from has been closed. And I think it's been due to COVID. <laughs> Sorry for that. A bit dramatic, wasn't it? So we're gonna try and make it ourselves today. How's that sound? Sound good? Sounds amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. All right, let's get started on the chicken, the chicken marinade. Now Nikita wanted me to get my toast out the um, out the way and my coffee, but excuse that. We've actually started pretty early in the morning because the chicken has to marinate for at least half an hour. The longer the better, overnight even. All right, so excuse my toast. Nikita was not impressed. I've already cut chicken thighs into bite-sized pieces here. That's gonna go in. 800 grams of chicken thighs. Now into that, we're gonna add half a cup of yogurt. We're gonna go in with one and a half tablespoons of garlic, one tablespoon of minced ginger. It's time to add, <laughs> don't make me laugh. It's time to add in all the spices that's gonna give the chicken the flavor that Nikita is nicely prepared for me. Two teaspoons of garam masala, one teaspoon of turmeric, one teaspoon of ground cumin, one teaspoon of red chili peppers. Red chili powder? Damn it! <laughs> one teaspoon of red chili powder. One teaspoon of red chili powder. There we go. One teaspoon of salt that I'm just gonna eyeball. Then we're gonna mix to combine. It's starting to go a nice color now. You can tell that's flavor town. All right, now we're gonna cover this up and put it in the fridge for at least half an hour. At least half an hour. Any less and it's gonna be no good. You may as well chuck it out. How long Nikita? At least half an hour. At least half an hour. I'm timing you guys. I can be very scary, can't I Nikita? Yes. Can't! Oh, it's not even big enough. <laughs> scary! The chicken is done everybody. We've been marinating it for probably a bit over an hour now actually. I'm talking to you. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think over an hour now. I've heated up a pan over here with a little bit of oil. I'm gonna get the pan really hot and then fry the chicken about three minutes aside just to get it browned. We're not gonna cook it the whole way through, we're just getting it browned. But the pan has to be really hot so you can get a nice browning action. We might have to do it in batches just so that the pan doesn't get crowded. Guys, look how good this chicken looks. It looks so amazing. It's so nicely browned. Whoa, it's black. It's black. <laughs> uh, chicken's all done. I'm gonna set this aside and get started on the sauce. I'm gonna add a mixture of oil and butter. Now you're supposed to use ghee, which is like a clarified butter that's in a lot of Indian cooking, but we couldn't get any of that because we're in Australia. To the pan, I'm gonna add some onions as well that I sliced up earlier. Now we want the onions to get a little bit sweaty. That looks really full of flavor. Yeah, all those black bits, all flavor. It's just flavor town. To the pan, I'm gonna add some garlic and ginger, minced. I wanna saute that for about a minute to get all the flavors to come out. Mmm, 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 flavor town. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. <laughs> All right, go away now. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Stop teasing. Because you know I'm going to put it all in. <laughs> <laughs> all right, to the pan, I'm going to add some spices now for some beautiful flavor. I've got some cumin, garam masala, and coriander. I'm going to pop all those in now. Get in there. And then now you know what they're going to do? The flavors are gonna dance! 
<laughs> You're really embarrassing yourself this video. Look at the flavors dancing. Do you want to do the flavor dance as well? No. Come on, do the I'm flavor I'm not embarrassing. Dance. Do what the flavors are doing in the pan. Here, I'm going to grab the camera. Go, do the flavor dance. <laughs> Come on, do the flavor dance. All right, guys, you can really smell the flavors because they've been dancing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to add some crushed tomatoes to it. 400 grams. The flavors are going to pause their dance for a little bit. And then the departed tomato is going to join them. A little bit of chili powder and a little bit of salt. I'm going to give that a stir. And I'm going to let these flavors dance for about 10 minutes. Wow. Right? <laughs> 10 minutes of dancing. Okay. I wish you guys could smell the smells coming out of our kitchen right now because it is beautiful. The flavors are really dancing together very well. They smell like they're dancing. What kind of dance? <laughs> what kind of dance? <laughs> the flavor dance? Mine's just a mild butter chicken, so it's only a little bit. No, it's not. It's a big flavor dance. <laughs> the sauce has really thickened up and gotten a nice beautiful red color. They've been doing a lot of dancing. Okay. <laughs> now I'm going to add the sauce mixture and put it into the blender. And then we're going to blend it all together. And it's just going to blend all the flavors and all the onion and all the good, you know, those black bits from before. And it's going to make a delicious sauce. We're going to give this a blend now. Now we might need to add water if it's a little bit too thick, but we'll see how we go. Ready? Yeah, ready. You turn it on first. Why <laughs> would you? I knew it wasn't on, I was waiting. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. See, now it's, got a, it's on, the light. All right, all right. I'm scared. I'm, I get so scared when I use blender. Is it supposed to do that? Uh, is it because it's too thick maybe? Or? All right, it's a little bit thick. I'm just going to add a little bit of water in. Boop. At most, a quarter cup, my friends. Nope. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we go. How long do you do it for? Until smooth, is it, or something? Oh, wow. Is it good? It's starting to really look like a buttered chicken now. Shall I be naughty and taste? She's spicy. Would you like to try? How spicy? It's spicy, but we still got to add all the cream and all that. It is an explosion of flavor. It has a lot of flavors. This had cream. Yep, yeah, this had cream. That is spicy. That is really spicy. There's so much flavor going on in there. Yeah. Indian cooking is so good. All right. We're going to add the sauce back onto the pan. Look at that color. It's so nice. Oh. What happened? You didn't. Oh my god. What the? Nothing happened. Nothing happened. What the? It's all good. It's all good. All right, to the beautiful sauce that we've made, I'm going to add a cup of cream. And I'm also going to add some sugar. Give this a mix. I've got the chicken and oh my god, even the chicken just smells amazing. I'm gonna add it back into the into the sauce mixture and can you see all that juice? All that juice is gonna go in there too. Imagine the dance that this is gonna make now. A good one. So we're gonna let that go for about 10 minutes so all the chicken's cooked through and so that the flavors can dance. So the chicken can dance with the sauce. I'm gonna call this episode Dancing with Daniel. <laughs> Let's have a little taste. The chef always gets a taste first. It's good. It's very good. Might be a bit spicy for you guys. A bit scared. Oh no. I'm going to taste it. 
That is delicious. That is so good. <laughs> it's time for my favorite part. Time to eat. More dancing. You've danced this whole episode. <laughs> We've gotten some garlic naan with us too. I can get a good dip of that. Did you get any chicken on there? Nah, I just got the sauce. We can try the sauce first. Cheers. Cheers. Holy moly. That's actually so good. Heavenly. It's heavenly? But spicy. There's so much flavor. Oh, it's so spicy. I wasn't expecting that much spice. Whoa. Okay, whoa. Sorry. There is so much flavor. You get like a hint of the tomatoes. Oh yeah. But it's like not overpowering. There's like a trillion other flavors in there as well. Mm -hmm. But mm, spicy. <laughs> and there's like a nice charred flavor from the, like the burnt kind of bits. It's actually delicious. Oh, we're yeah. gonna try it with chicken. Shall we get some chicken? Yeah. There's my bite. Are you ready to pour a bite of chicken? Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Holy moly. So good. So spicy, I'm dying. <laughs> it's just so much flavor. My brain almost can't even comprehend how much flavor is in this. For me, I liked a little bit of spice. I would say this is a mild, the mild heat. My nose is running. <laughs> Nikita's dying. For me, it's it's very nice. It's a very nice amount of heat. The, the naan's good. <laughs> the naan is actually good. This is just from a packet. I'm quite happy with this. Yeah, I'm gonna have one more and you can have this. You know what, that heat builds up. I can see why you can't handle this. It does build up. <laughs> <laughs> I might put some yogurt in mine later. Yeah, put some yogurt in it. That'd be delicious. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna need some water. <laughs> Kay has some water. Uh, I'll just take over the eating. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually fantastic, this curry. The flavor coming out of the sauce is just amazing though. It's like a slight bitterness because of the chard. It's chilly, it's sweet, it's creamy. It's actually got like every single flavor profile out there. I'm just letting you eat, it's too spicy. I'm gonna get yogurt. That's a good thing about being able to eat spice. Sometimes Nikita can't eat the spice and the food's so good, so I just get more food. Hey, but the food's so good, I'm like killing myself so I can eat it. All right, I'm gonna try it with you. Oh. Good. So much better. Yeah. It adds a different element. Cause it's like Greek yogurt, is that like sour? It's so yum, try it. Do you want some? Here's my bite with yogurt. The aftertaste is still very spicy though. <laughs> mm. The dollop of yogurt's really nice. It's like a relief from the heat. It's nice and cool and creamy. I'm so glad we've made this because this is actually so delicious. Well, you made it for me. Thank yes, you. I did. No worries. I loved it actually, loved it. Thank you for watching us make butter chicken, everybody. And we'll dancing. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. Ciao, 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 ciao. Thank you very much for joining us, everybody. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already and then watch this video next for 25 years of good luck.